Shabbat Shalom. Shabbat Shalom. How are you? I'm, I'm well. Yeah, you doing okay? Yeah, I'm doing okay. Just okay? Just okay. Another gorgeous day. It is. It's beautiful. It's beautiful, beautiful. Yeah. yeah bit, bit, like, uh, like Summer. Hi, hi, Ellie. Morning, Ellie. Morning, Wendy. That was so sweet last night when the with the new children. Wasn't that great? I know they're so adorable. They're so adorable. How, how is it Susan's husband that puts this all together? Uh, no, last night it was a combination of Cantor Braun, uh, Elon, and I think Lindsay Hagen, who all worked on it. Oh, it was it was lovely. Yeah, you know what? It's. Uh, such a good time to try to be creative, right? And and connect all the dots and yeah, 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 it's good. It's good, it's good. They were adorable, they were adorable. How are you doing with this? I'm doing, I'm doing, thanks for asking. It's, uh, it's, it's a busy time, it is a busy time, right? Trying to, uh, it's like patting your head and rubbing your stomach all the time, you know, kind of trying to figure out how to do both pieces, the, the technology, which, you know, is brand new to us, but, but we're quick studies, we gotta be quick studies, so. It's, so you know what, the people have been great. Pardon me? Do you go into Temple? I, I work mostly from home, mostly from home. Um, and, and every once in a while I go in if I need a book or to do something that, uh, you, you know, I have a lot of my books actually, I've brought a handful of them home. Um, but my kids are in school two days a week, so I, I need to be cautious as well. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. Now, what do they do the other three days? Uh, so, so they're all, it's, it's all remote the other three days. One of the days, they, they do it by alphabet. One of the days, um, they have all online learning, you know, kind of as their schedule would be. Um, they, they log on and, and uh, their teachers teach online. And then the other two days a week, it's supplementary learning that their teachers post online and then they are self-directed. Do they get to do art and, and phys ed and, and the other? They do. They do. They do indeed, yep. They do indeed. They do indeed. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. yep. Hi, Reba Mazeltov. Thank you. And I wanted to thank you for making the announcement at yeah. Temple because I got an e I forgot a, somebody who I wanted to share it with said that she heard you announce it and she wanted details. Details. Good. 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 So I gave them. Um, and I'm very happy uh, that she's. Uh, if my daughter's kind to me, she'll let me hold him at some point. <laughs> you're, you also, you're still in Italy. Oh yeah. Nice, 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 nice. How's your but, daughter? How's your daughter feeling? She's good. Good. Yeah. Good. I mean, I had 14 day quarantine when I got here, and when I go back to New York, I have a 14 day quarantine. Yeah. So, okay. um, you know, it's hard, but I'm happy to be here. Yeah. Good. How's the baby doing? Oh my God, he's so great. Good. <laughs> Did you ever hear a grandparent not say that? Yeah, and I, but, but you know, each one gets bragging rights. Each one gets bragging rights. Yeah, yeah, really. I mean, yeah, he's, he's great. Good. Is it your daughter's first one? He's the first on both sides of the family. Nice. He's the first. Very, very so nice. He's just, just so special. <laughs> Good, good, good. May he bring you much nachas, much joy, much joy. Thank you. Mazel tov, Reba. Thank you. Thank Mazel you. Tov. Shabbat shalom, Alan. Shabbat shalom, Lekulam, to everybody. And congratulations. Thank you. Thank you very what's much. The, what's the boy's name? His name is Joseph Francesco Rispoli. Do they live in Rochester? No. <laughs> so when are you going to go visit him? I'm there. I'm here. I was here for his birth. Oh, okay. Alan, ask Reba where here is. Where's here? I'm in Milan, Italy. Oh, Italy. I've been in Milan. Oh, yeah. Yeah. So After the Second World War, my in-laws... Uh, lived in Milano till they could go to Israel. And my mother-in-law was pregnant with my wife. My wife was born in Israel, but she was pregnant. So it was very nice, very nice in Milano. Milano. 
It's in mm -hmm. North Italy. In the north, yeah. Yeah. You ever it's, been there, Rabbi? I have not. I would love to go. I would love to go. It's beautiful. Very beautiful. Yeah. It's a it's a really major city. All kinds of art and architecture and ah. It's fabulous. It's on, it's on my list, on my pl my list of many places that I would like to visit. I would love to How go. How long will you stay there, Reba? Uh, this, well, this trip is two months, and then I'm going to come home. Then I'm going to come back when her husband has to go to work. He's He works in Positano. That's the south of Italy, or the middle, Yeah. on the Mediterranean. And when yeah. he's gone, then I'll come back and babysit. Nice. And... <laughs> Enjoy. And That's all I have to say. Can, until they can do the next step of it. I yeah. think I'll end up being here six months and in Rochester six months. Perfect. Are you learning Italian? Yes. I, I did a little bit ahead of time of Italian, and I'm listening. So in the beginning, when the, she was talking to the appointments, the midwives came to the house I'm listening with my headphones and it's printing out the translation in the Google Translate so I could get more. And I've been watching the TV so I can kind of pick up the sounds. Um, I, I think I did my first sentence. Um, I'm not sure what it was, but I think I was proud of myself because it's so much harder to speak than to listen. And I'm yes. Absolutely, absolutely. Good for you. Translate for me if I need it. Yeah. She's completely bilingual. Is she is she completely bilingual? Yeah. Yeah. Will they raise the baby speaking both? She'll speak English. She'll speak Italian. I'll speak English. A little nice. Yiddish thrown in there. Nice. nice, nice, nice. <laughs> My late wife hey, yes, nine languages. Amazing. Amazing. Hi, Cantor Braun. Shabbat shalom. Shabbat How are you? How's everybody? When I went to Europe. Eva. Esther. Emma. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to. Shabbat shalom, Wendy. Is Wendy there? Look at me. I have no idea. Esther, how are you? And this this service is a perfect time for me, 4.30 in the afternoon. Right, right. I try so hard to stay up for the rabbi's class at night. I can't do it. And I tried for the, for the service last night. I couldn't stay up. So perfect. You're, you're not on the 24-hour schedule with the baby? No, but I tell them if they want, anytime. I, I'll fall back asleep anytime they want me. Just yeah. call. Congratulations, Reba. Hi. Hi, RJ. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. You know, um, Jackie reads me the mail, and we got a card from the mitzvah committee uh, that um, said that they made a donation to buy a children's book in the library. I was thrilled, and Jackie was very teary-eyed. It was so wonderful. <laughs> but we all love you, Reba. <laughs> thank you so much. I, you know, I tell him every time he opens his eyes, which is about a minute or two a day when I have him <laughs> and I'm, I'm telling him all the people who love him. And I did, I did mention the, you know, first the family and then the Temple Sinai and Temple Sinai loves all the people in Temple Sinai oh, love him. <laughs> he liked that. Good, good. He should know early. He should know early and often. <laughs> right. mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. He's a good boy. Very good. I want, really wanted to take him to a sukkah and I couldn't. Yeah. Uh, in its right time, in its right time. When all, when all is well and it's safe for him and for you, it'll, it'll be the right time. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Good morning, what was Shabbat, shalom. Shabbat Shalom. Shabbat Shalom. Reba, what date was he born? He was born on Sukkot, the second day, October 2nd. October 2nd, okay, good. good so good. I really yeah. wanted to bring him in a sukkah and there was a, a progressive um, congregation mm -hmm. somewhere in Milan, and I had to Zoom it for Rosh Hashanah, Yom Kippur. But they, I tried to find a sukkah, but I didn't find one. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, it's, it's, it probably wouldn't have been safe. 
Yeah, it's, uh, you, you know what, I, I think a lot of people were yearning to be in, in Ahsoka this year and, uh, and and struggled to find a safe way to do it. So so please God next year, please God. Something to look forward to. So, Rebba, since you had such a wonderful simcha, would you like to do the, pray, the, the Torah blessings today? Would you you like beat me to the punch canter. I was going to ask her the very same thing. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Would yeah, you like to um, recite? The, I don't the, the anything Torah blessings. that has it written. Is it written somewhere? Um, It'll show up on the screen. Okay. The Torah good. blessings will be on the screen, so you're just going to recite the opening blessing. Yeah, it's the same. And, too. Right, and okay. then um, Pauline Rosenberg will chant from the the Torah and then you will do the closing blessing. You know, Okay, okay, good, so, good, good. Morning, right. Good. I want to tell my daughter, maybe my, I get the baby and the women here. All right. Excuse me for just a minute. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. And so, um, Rabbi, we also have somebody for Brashid. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Hi, Ellie. Good to see you. Good to see you. Hey. Good to see everybody. Thank you, Thank you so much for adding those names. Yeah, it was a great suggestion. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. Appreciated it. Hi, Bob. Shabbat Shalom. Shabbat Shalom, Rabbi. Shabbat Shalom. Shabbat Shalom. Thank Shabbat you. Shalom. Hag Sameach. Hag Sameach. Hag Sameach. I want to tell you that my wife is flying to Italy uh, next week. Where? Into Milan? I'm not sure, but she's she's flying from the Netherlands to, and then she's going to rent a car and travel around. Well, then she needs to come to me. Send me, um, send me the, send me I the. Think that, I don't know how they do it. I'm going to have to. I'll be in touch with her then. She asked me. Oh, okay. But I'll be in touch. I'll check. I'll see if I can get in touch there. Thank you. I knew she was in the Netherlands, just by herself or with one of the children. With the two children. Oh, two children. Yeah. So now we have a uh, we have a remote everything from everyone. <laughs> Bob, 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 could we um, Bob, could we offer you in in your father's memory? Could we offer you one of the Eliot today for tour service? Uh, thank you. I'd appreciate that. Okay. Wonderful. Good. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. So you'll, you'll, yours will be the second one when we um, will we'll finish reading Deuteronomy, um, Reba in honor of, uh, of her new grandson. And, uh, and, and we would be honored if you would offer the second one around Bereshit in, in memory of your dad. That would be lovely. Great, that'll, that'll be fun. The, the, it, uh, it'll be the on the screen. It'll yeah, be on the screen for you. Yeah. Thank you, Rev. I appreciate it. Yeah, pleasure. Thank you. Pleasure. Esther, it's a beautiful day to be outside for for uh, for the morning worship, isn't it? Isn't it? And no no clock, so you'll have to start on your own. Uh, I'm all good. I'm all good. I worked long enough with Rabbi Katz to mind the time. <laughs> <laughs> we'll start in just a couple minutes. I'll uh, actually one to be precise, uh, and uh, I'll mute everybody. And then for those of you who have honors, um, it, it's set up for you to unmute yourself. Okay, when the time comes, we'll we'll just we'll call you and uh, and you can just unmute your square. If you have any problem, just let us know. Okay. Okay. Did you all read on the, at the DNC? Yes, I think it was yesterday about the uh, about doing a sukkah on a pickup truck. I think it, God forbid, will have will do it will happen again uh, next uh -huh. year. But we don't have to. We cannot do it. I'm going to build one on my. You know, Ilan, maybe we should bring, maybe we should look ahead and, and build the Hanukkah, you know? Okay, I'm, mu I'm muting everybody right now. <laughs> Hanukkah on the I, It's like my kids. If I go la la la, it won't happen. I'm going to mute everybody. <laughs> maybe I should make a souvenir to everyone and delivery. Exactly. Oh, well, great. So That's many good so ideas, right, Rabbi? Yeah, so lots of, we were saying for lots of good ideas to, to, to help us think outside of the box, for sure, for sure, for sure. <laughs> Shabbat Shalom, everybody. Shabbat Shalom. And, uh, Shabbat Shalom and Chag Sameach. We're, we're grateful to, to start Shabbat morning and, and our Chag 
you know, to continue our Chag together with you, the end of Simchat Torah, and uh, and for those who are uh, here for Yisker as well, we'll, we'll we will recite Yisker mm-hmm. in the service, and uh, and and hope that your memories, um, that 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 being together helps to, uh, to to deepen your memories and and the sense of community helps to support you during this time as well. Shabbat Shalom, Shabbat Shalom. We will start this morning as we do each Shabbat morning and and festival morning with the singing of Mato Vu, and we invite you please to join us. Shabbat Shalom. Uh, we'll, we'll start um, with the singing of Mato Vu. I'm just going to get my slides in order. Chag Sameach, Shabbat Shalom. <clears throat> please join me with Mato Vu. Mato Vu, Mato Vu, Oh, Let us continue together. Please pray pray with us when you see the words in front of you. Join us and, and pray with us as we say, Praise to you, Adonai, our God, sovereign of the universe, who formed the human body with skill, creating the body's many pathways and openings. It is well known before your throne of glory that if one of them be wrongly opened or closed, it would be impossible to endure and stand before you. Baruch Ata Adonai, Rofecho Basar Umafli Laasot. I find by my experience, not by reasoning, but by my own discovery that God is near me and I can be near God at all times. I can't explain it, but I am as sure of my experience as I am of the fact that I live and love. I cannot explain how I've come to live and love, but I know I do. And in the same way, I know I am in contact with God. Please join us with Psalm 150. As always, we encourage you to use your percussion instruments or hands, or like Rabbi Till says, you can use your body, tapping your shoulder. <clears throat> Oh, <laughs> 
We feel it, we feel it. I saw Shelly also had some percussion instruments. Bring them to our services, right? It lends joy, especially at this time for Simchat Torah, and especially at this time when joy is uh, is the good kind of contagious. We encourage you to uh, to bring whatever instruments you have to services and, and let us imagine the sound and feel the sound. Let's continue praying together. Praised are you, sovereign of wonders, crowned in adoration, delighted in song, eternal majesty. <clears throat> Heat kadal be kadash me raba. Domadi berachira te be amnit mohate be chaye chon. Uviu me chon uchaye de chobit Israel. Bagala bagala. Uvisman kari be imeru. Amen. Yehish me raba me borach. continue with our call to worship, we invite you, please, in body or in spirit, to rise. <laughs> continue together. Our world is beyond our knowledge, greater than our understanding. Help us, God, to accept what we cannot understand, to love the beauty of creation without trying to control it. Teach us to bend with life, to repair what we can repair, to live with our questions, and to rejoice in your wonders. Baruch Ata Adonai Yotzer Hamerot, our praise to you, Adonai, creator of the cosmic lights. Baruch Ata Adonai Please be seated. Please join me. Via ta heba de naila heha, behole mokha, behole nafsheha, behole odeha, behayod barim haene, asher anahim et sabeha, hayom alebabeha. Veshin adam lebanecha vedibarta abaham Veshif decha bevitecha Uvelechtecha abaderech Ushob becha avkumecha Ukshartam lehot ayadecha Vehayu erdafot binenecha Uhtavta amal mezuzot beitecha visharecha like Moses, Miriam, and all Israel, we sing out and we rejoice. Yai la 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 la
continue now as we turn to the tefillah. You will notice some additions for the Chag and, and some additions given the season that we are in as we head from fall into winter, our prayers change. So please do pay attention, notice those, and join us as we pray together. We say pray as if everything depends on God and act as if everything depended on you. We invite you please, in body or in spirit, to rise. Adonai sefer takiftah fi agit hiratecha. Adonai open up my lips that my mouth may declare your praise. Baruch atah Adonai Eloheinu melahem v'teinu v'imoteinu. Elohe Abraham, Elohe Yitzchak, Elohe Yaakov. Elohe Yisra, Elohe Yisra, Elohe Rachel. Remember those whose hearts poured out to you like water, who trusted that the journey would lead to you. For Abraham and Sarah's faith, do not withhold water. Remember the one chosen for her words, please take some water. And remember the one whose blood was almost spilled like water. For Rebecca and Isaac's righteousness, grant water. Remember how Jacob crossed the river to wrestle in the waters of his conscience. Recall the sisters' tears, their waters of birth, their tents of peace. For Jacob, Rachel, and Leah, fill the earth with needed water. Leave Racha velo le Kala, the Chaim velo le Mabit, the Sova velo le Ratzon, for blessing and not for curse, for life and not death, for abundance, not want. Please sing with me the Kedusha. Nekadesh Shim Haba Holom, Kishim Shimagishim, Tobish Mimarum, Kakatu Viliat Viyaha, the Kuruz of the Heavy Homar. Kadosh, 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 Adonai Tzevot, Melah Haaretz Kevoto, Adir Adirin Adonai, Adonai Numa Adir Shimcha, Mecha Haaretz, Baruch 
Please be seated. Atava Khartanu Mikola Amin, Ahafta Otanu Varatsita Banu Varamam Tanu Mikola Lishanot, Vakidash Tanu Bamitzvotecha, Vakir of Tanu Malkenu, La Avodotecha, the Simcha Hagadol, the Hakadosh, Alenu Karata, Vatitan Lanu Adonai Elohine Beahava, Shabbatot, the Minucha, Umaudim, the Simcha, Chagim Uzmanim, the Sasson at Yom Yom Shabbat. Yeah, yes, yes, yes. Yom HaShabbat Hazeh Ba'et Yom. I was trying to read them together. Yom HaShmini HaTzeret Hazeh Zman Sivchatinu Mikro HaKodesh Zecher L'Tziat Mitzrayim. You have chosen us in love and favor by making us holy through your mitzvot and drawing us close to your service, that through us your great and holy name may become known in all the earth. In your love, Adonai, our God, you have given us Shabbatot of rest, feasts of gladness, and seasons of joy, this Shabbat day and this festival of Atzeret Simchat Torah, season of rejoicing, to unite in worship and recall the exodus from Egypt. Eloheinu ve'elohei avotenu ve'imotenu, ya'alei ve'yavo, our God and God of our ancestors, be mindful of your people Israel and recall our merit for good and for grace, and in loving kindness and compassion for life and for peace, on this festival of Atzeret Simchat Torah, Zohreinu Adonai Eloheinu Bo Litova. Amen. Ofokdeinu Bo Livracha. Amen. Hoshienu Bo Lechaim. Amen. This day, remember us for well-being. Amen. This day, bless us with your nearness. Amen. And this day, help us to a fuller life. Amen. We praise you, Adonai, who sanctifies Shabbat, the house of Israel, and the festivals. Baruch Ata Adonai Mekadesh HaShabbat, Yisrael Bahazmanim. Blessed are you, Adonai, whose presence returns to Zion. We join together in saying, Baruch Ata Adonai HaMachazir Shechinato L'Tzion. Baruch Ata Adonai HaTov Shimcha Ulechana El Hodot. Let us continue with our prayers for peace. We invite you, please, to join us in song. Sim, 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 shalom, sim, 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 shalom, sim, 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 shalom, tova, brata. Take a few moments, each of us, in our own way, with intention, in silence, in prayer, in meditation.
Is customary for us on on Chag on on these Chagim, especially these fall Chagim, to uh, to offer Hallel psalms of praise and and we invite you please to, to sing with us to pray with us. We begin with the prayer for for Hallel, which will be recited by the cantor. But please do join us as we offer specific praise for this season, this time, and this time of joy. Baruch Adonai, Eloheinu melech alam, Asher kibishanu b'mitzvotav, V'tzivanu l'ikroi chachalel. Amen. Please join me as we recite uh, Psalm 118. Uh, this melody, most of you know it by the Friedman. Please join me. We say those words on Yom Kippur. We say it a lot at the end of the Neila. But I think also there is another traditional interpretation, Rabbi, correct me if I'm wrong, that Sukkot and Simchat Torah is like a last chance to ask God to open the gates, to have a prayer, because this is the last, very, very, very last chance to enter the gates of righteousness. So we all fulfill the obligation by singing the psalm. 
to enter into righteousness of gates. <clears throat> we okay. continue, yeah, we continue now with our Seder Kriyata Torah. For those who were able to join us last night, we had a beautiful opportunity to, to, uh, to both hear and feel the, the, mm. the symbolic unrolling of the Torah uh, that, that we customarily do on Simchat Torah, Arab Simchat Torah and, uh, and, and, and dance with the Torah, how we wish we could do that this year as well. But of special note last night, what were the, those who were becoming consecrated and, uh, and seeing their beautiful faces and hearing their voices as uh, as they stood under our digital ca canopy right as they stood under our tally tote under our arms under our love under under the hopes that we all have for them so we we invite you to do that again this morning as we as we unroll the torah we we uh we had a small opportunity in in the building one of very few that we all bring together and uh and, and we unroll the torah and show you uh show you what what uh, what we long to see and and hear in person again in its right time. So the here the people you'll recognize um, as Rabbi mentioned. So that's that much we can unroll. And we don't read it that quickly, but we come to it. We're, we know that we're supposed to come quickly to a mitzvah, right? That we are, we're supposed to hasten to, to, uh, to do a mitzvah and make it beautiful. So we, we know that we are making our Torah reading beautiful by those who have honored us by offering this morning's Torah reading and those who have the Eliot around us. Uh, so, uh, so we are so, so thankful that, uh, that Reba joins us from, from Milan with, with her newborn grandson and let Torah, let Torah be heard for him this, this day, this season, let him hear it often. And, and Reba, we are delighted that, uh, that you have accepted the honor of, of the first Aliyah. As we complete the book, the reading of the book of Deuteronomy, and then as I mentioned last night, we start right back with our reading of Genesis, that there should be no break in our reading, that, that though we finish it, we never actually finish it. We start again, there is, we say, that we turn the Torah, and turn the Torah, or in some cases, unroll it and unroll it, and and discover something new and and awesome in it each time. Reba, we are uh, we, we are excited that we have Joseph with us, right? Oh, you're muted. Let me unmute you. You probably are short of hand. Hold on. Unmute. Okay. Come on, Lilliyah, Amen. Did you not want me to start? Oh, <laughs> yeah, yes, Pauline, please. Thank you. Yes. Vaya Asher Adonai et kol ha'aretz et ha'gilad adan ve'et kol ha'naftali ve'et eret Ephraim umnashe ve'et ve'et kol eret Yehuda ad hayam ha'acharon ve'et ha'negev ve'et ha'kikar Ve'enecha, ve'shama lo ta'avor. Ay 
Et kavura to ad hayom hazeh, O Moshe, ben me'av esrim shana v'moto, velo kachata eno velo nas lecho, v'yivku v'nei Yisrael et Moshe, Arbot mo av shroshim yom. Ye may be he ever moshe. Moshua be noon. Mel vale ruach hochma. Kisamach moshe. Et ya dav a lav. Vaish me u elav in Israel. Vayasu. Ka'asher tziva Adonai et Moshe. Velo kam nabi od v'Yisrael ha'Moshe. Asher yidao Adonai panim hal panim. V'chol ha'otod omovdim. Asher shalachu Adonai, Adonai la'asod be'eretz Mitzrayim. Lefaro uchol abado, abadav uchol artso. Uchol ayad ha'chazaka, uchol ha'mora ha'gadol. Asher asa Moshe. Beautiful. 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 Amen. And we say, chazak, chazak, v'nit chazek. Be strong, be strong, and let us be strengthened by the words of Torah, by the generations who have heard Torah before us, by the generations who are with us in prayer this morning, by <laughs> strong and beautiful Torah reading. And, uh, and, and we, we know that while there was never another as great as Moses, who, who was a prophet for us, who rose up in, in Israel again, there are many of his descendants who we are blessed to have in community and, uh, and, and we thank you, we thank you. We continue right away with our continuation of our, our start of Brace Sheet and, and as is the cycle of life, we continue on. We ask Bob, please, in, in memory to recite the Eliot and, uh, and we connect one generation to the next as we continue with Torah. Amen. <laughs> Amen. Breshit bara Elohim et hashamayim be et haaretz be haaretz haita tohu vabohu be choshech apnei tehom beruach Elohim berachefet apnei hamayim. Vayomer Elohim yehi or, vayehi or. Vayar Elohim et ha'or. Ki tov, vayabdel Elohim, ben ha'or u ben ha'choshech. 
Vayikra Elohim Lahor Yom Velachoshech Kara Laila Vayi Erev Vayi Vohocher Yom Echad Vayom Elohim Yehi Rakia Betoch Hamayim Vehi Mafil Bein Mayim La Mayim Vayas Vayas Nope, that's help a little bit. Is that a weird one? Help, help. Um, just, just go ahead. Just, it was fine. Go ahead. That's not right. I don't know. Etaraki. I'm just going to read it. Vaya, vaya deil, vein hamayim asher mitachat larakia. Uvein hamayim asher me'al arakia vayichen vayikra Elohim larakia shamayim vayere vayivoker yom sheni. Thank you, Susan. Was beautiful. Baruch Atah Adonai Eloheinu Melech Olam. Asher natan lanu tarat emet v'chaye olam natab kohenu baruch atad amai natein haTorah. Amen. 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 And uh, and and we we read through days one and two and the distinction between light and day, and we know that separation is and can be good and holy, and and we thank those who have had Torah honors. And we encourage you as we as we re-roll the Torah, as we as we uh, dance with the Torah to as you did last night. Please dance in your squares and join us as we as we celebrate, and we re-roll the Torah only to be read again soon and uh, and on and often. As I said last night, we miss you and we miss having the Torah where it should be, which is in all of our arms and, uh, and moving through the congregation. But we know that it is safe in your hearts and safe in your, in your minds and, uh, and safe in your daily living and, and how you move forward the teachings of the Torah every day. And that is ultimately what is most important, that we, uh, that we hear the words that were just shared so strongly and beautifully by each of our Torah chanters and, uh, and, and that we live them most importantly, that we remember them and that we live them. We turn our prayers now to those who, uh, who, who also give shape and meaning and depth to our every day, those who, uh, who are um, who are with us and who are ailing, who are, whose spirits are, are, are aching, whose bodies are aching. And, and we pray for their strength and we pray for their vigor and we pray for their wholeness and that they return to the very best that they can be and, uh, and that, that we, uh, we, we include all of them in our prayers as we say. May the one who blessed our ancestors, Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, Sarah, Rebecca, Rachel, and Leah, bless and strengthen those who are struggling. This morning, we are holding in our prayers as we held the Torah and, and held it firmly and lovingly. We hold these also who need our help being held up and our prayers for strength and wholeness. We are praying for Thomas DiMatteo and Mark Friedman, Elizabeth Friedman, Shana Esterbat Rochel, Chris Sora, Joel Shamaskin, Chaya Nechabat Rivalea, Simon Brightman, Barbara Baer, Katriel Parachia Ben Herschel Laser Vishoshana, Sally Graf, Sarah Bat Avraham Vesara, 
William Fawcett Jr., Alan Skirker, Chaim Ben Saradina Vihoshua, Laura Braun, mm -hmm. Shulamit Buzo, Raymond Condome, Susan Sultan Tobias, Pamela Labat Blackwell, Sandra Vella, Lori Friedman, Barbara DiCario, Eric Weiner, Marie Eichner, Kim Stanger Delisle, Grace Hughes, Jack Hughes, Yafa Sara Bat Miriam Utsvi Hirsch, Tudi Driscoll, Ralph Bookbinder, Leona Johnson, Eileen Kaplan, Joyce Grossman, Lee Gordon, Patrick Doherty, Miriam Bat Ella, Randy Weiss, Eli Waxler Felder, Lynn Fragan, Barb Snyderman, and Barb Miller. If there are others whom you would add to our list for healing, for wholeness, for strength, please, please share them in the chat box at this time. We add to our prayers, Marvin Horowitz, Ernie Zlachauer, Marsha Scharfman, Leslie Frank, Patty Newman, Judy Weiner, Ed Bullard, Gloria Schachter, Alice Co uh, Kos uh, Kosian, Paul Hade, Lisa Baker, Amy Peck, Gaspari, Patrick Tarconi, David Altabelli, Howard Itkin, Milt Glend, Harry Ben Vivian, Dallas Ben Amber, Chloe Orvec, Baby Emma Gaspari. Let's add to our prayers those who continue to struggle with the coronavirus, those who are treating those and tending to those and caring for those who are struggling with the virus, those <laughs> who have no one to say a prayer for them, but are in our thoughts and, and in our hearts and most assuredly in our prayers. As we pray, the Holy Blessed One be filled with compassion for their health to be restored and their strength to be revived. May God swiftly send them renewal of body and renewal of spirit. And let us all join together in saying, Amen. Amen. May the source of strength who blessed the ones before us help us find the courage to make our lives a blessing and let us say Amen. join together in saying Amen. 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 I share with you just a few brief words just ahead of uh, Viesker. Perhaps you know these words that have been written by Bob Perks, who writes that recently, he, he says, recently I overheard a mother and a daughter in their last moments together at the airport as the daughter's departure had been announced. Standing near the security gate, they hugged and the mother said, I love you and I wish you enough. And the daughter replied, Mom, our life together has been more than enough. Your love is all I've ever needed. And I wish you enough too, Mom. They kissed and the daughter left. The mother walked over to the window where I sat and standing there, I could see that she wanted and needed to cry. I tried not to intrude on her privacy, but she welcomed me in and, and asked, did you ever say goodbye to someone knowing it would be forever? Yes, I have, I replied. Forgive me for asking, but why is this a forever goodbye? I am old and she lives so far away. I have challenges ahead and the reality is that the next trip back will likely be for my funeral, she said. 
when you were saying goodbye, I heard you say, I wish you enough. May I ask what that means? And she began to smile. That's a wish that has been handed down from other generations. My parents used to say it to everyone. She paused a moment and she looked up as if trying to remember it in detail and she smiled even more. When we said, I wish you enough, we were wanting the other person to have a life filled just enough with just enough good things to sustain them. Then turning toward me, she shared the following, reciting it in fact from memory. And these are her words. I wish you enough sun to keep your attitude bright. I wish you enough rain to appreciate the sun more. I wish you enough happiness to keep your spirit alive. I wish you enough pain so that the smallest joys in life appear much bigger. I wish you enough gain to satisfy your wanting. I wish you enough loss to appreciate all that you possess. I wish you enough hellos to get you through the final goodbye. She then began to cry and walked away. As we gather this morning in celebration of Simchat Torah and in memory of our loved ones to recite Yisker, we think of what would be enough how much time would we agree was enough? How many birthdays together would be enough? How many holidays? How many life cycle moments? How many laughs? How many dinners together? How much time would we agree was enough? On this day, Judaism reminds us on the eighth day shall be an atzeret for you. But the meaning of the word atzeret is, is somewhat obscure. The best explanation seems to come from the word atzor, which means hold back or to cling to or to try to retain. After the close of the seven days of the festival of Sukkot, of Sukkot the eighth day is traditionally atzeret, you know this word, a clinging to this joyous holiday that is passing. It is natural for us to want to hold on to joyous experiences. It is natural for us to want to hold on to and hold fast to happy times. But nobody, none of us, can stay the passage of time. The very same sukkah, which was so glorious and beautiful at the beginning of the week, has in fact faded and likely lost some of its beauty, some of its attractiveness, its leaves and its covering, dry up some until by the end of the week, there is in fact less shade than there is light and the sukkah is no longer a valid ritual for us to use and to observe as it has given way. And so after this last fall holiday, we leave the sukkah behind and we move on and into the rest of our year ahead. So too in life, there are many moments when we would like to declare an atzeret and make a determined effort to hold on to the experiences and the joys we were privileged to have, the beauty we enjoyed, to hold on to the fat, hold fast to the happiness that we enjoyed. We want to, we yearn to cling to a love that has been. It has not felt like enough. But life has a way of ensuring that we do not remain in the past. Time moves on, and so, so too must we. We must step forth into the world of life, a life blessed by memory, we pray, as we sow seeds for a new harvest, strengthened and encouraged by the good memories of our loved ones who have passed. And this is among the many lessons that this holiday holds for us as we gather this morning and we remember. Though we would have liked to have kept our loved ones with us for many, many more years, we aspire to feel grateful that though they leave us, 
they have left us with a rich store of memories to treasure and to hold on to as we imagine enough hellos to make the goodbye possible. For we are all a people of memory and prayer. These are the words that were spoken on January 16th, 1996 by Ezra Weitzman, the then president of Israel, who wrote, we are a people of words and hope. We have neither established empires nor built castles and palaces. We have only placed words on top of each other. And then he went on to say, and today, as we hold on and cling to the memory of our loved one, we know that memory is like a prayer. Rabbi Kerry Olitsky offers us comfort by knowing that the Jewish people is not merely a people with a history. It is a people with a memory. A memory is a blessing. It is that memory that has sustained us through our wanderings. It is that memory that has driven us and motivated us and goaded us to dream of a more perfect time and a more perfect world. Memory, like prayer, is made up of words, and those words can be placed together, encouraging us to lead a better life and a more meaningful life. Rabbi Abraham Joshua Heschel taught us that there are three ways to respond to sorrow. On the first level, we cry. On the second level, we are silent. And on the highest level, we take sorrow and turn it into a song. Let us hold on to, let us cling gently to the notion that that which they offered us, the joys of long ago, all that was indeed enough and is in fact the song that we sing in their memory. We say, can you hear what song? Let it be so. Let it be so. We continue now with our prayers for Yisker and we invite you please to pray with us. Birth is a beginning and death a destination, and life is a journey from childhood to maturity, and youth to age, from innocence to awareness and ignorance to knowing, from foolishness to discretion and then perhaps to wisdom, from weakness to strength, or from strength to weakness and often back again from health to sickness, and we pray to health again, from offense to forgiveness, from loneliness to love, from joy to gratitude, from pain to compassion, from grief to understanding, from fear to faith, from defeat to defeat to defeat, until not looking backwards or ahead, we see that victory lies not at some high point along the way, but in having made the journey step by step, a sacred pilgrimage, for birth is a beginning and death a destination, and life is a journey. <clears throat> we continue now as we recite the words of the 23rd Psalm, words that are familiar and bring comfort to so many of us. We would ask you please to join with us. <laughs> Shanta 
Join together in the words of Psalm 121. I lift up my eyes to the hills. From where does my help come? My help comes from God who made heaven and earth. God will not let your foot be moved. He who God will not let your foot be moved. He who keeps you will not slumber. Behold, he who keeps Israel will neither slumber nor sleep. God is your keeper. God is your shade at your right hand. The sun shall not strike you by day, nor the moon by night, but God will keep you from all evil will keep your life. God will keep your going out and your coming in for this time forth and forevermore. Continue with the Psalm 16. Shibit Yoronai Lenegdit Amid Kimimini Bale Each person has a name. We each have a name given by God and given by our father and mother. We each have a name given by our stature and smile and given by our attire. We each have a name given by the hills and given by the walls. We each have a name given by the stars and given by our friends. We each have a name given by our sins and given by our yearnings. We each have a name given by our enemies and given by love. We each have a name given by celebrations and given by our work. We each have a name given by the seasons and given by our blindness. We each have a name given by the sea and given by our death. We invite you please to pray, to meditate in silence. We pray that the life of your loved ones, those whom you are remembering today, though perhaps not enough, becomes the song you sing the song that lifts your heart, the song that brings you comfort, the song that brings you meaning. We invite you, please, to rise as we continue with El Malay Rachamim. <laughs> Shahim Amrani, 
Fully compassionate God on high, to our loved ones who have entered eternity, grant clear and certain rest with you in the lofty heights of the sacred and pure, whose brightness shines like the very glow of heaven, source of mercy, forever enfold them in the embrace of your wings, secure their souls in eternity. Adonai, they are yours. They will rest in peace, and we all of us join together in saying, hmm. Amen. Amen. Let us continue as we remember and we turn to our concluding prayers, the Elenu. Elenu l'shabiyach l'adon ha'kol l'ater g'dalar yaser b'reshit sh'lo sal g'yaratzot v'lo samano g'mishpahot ha'dama Shemosam chalkinu tahem Vigoro leinu techol hamonam Vanachno konim Umishtahavim umojim Lifne melech malche hamlahim Hakadosh baruhu Vneemar evhayadonai Lemelech al kohoharetz Bayom ha-hu, bayom ha-hu, Yehi Adonai echad. Ushemo, ushemo, ushemo echad. Our thoughts turn to those who have departed this earth, our own loved ones, those whom our friends and neighbors have lost the martyrs of our people whose graves are unmarked and those of every race and every nation whose lives have been a blessing to humanity. We remember them. We hear their song. We learn from them and we honor them. We meditate on the meaning of love and loss, of life and death. We think of our loved ones death has recently taken from us and those who died at this season in years past and those whom we have drawn into our hearts with our own. During the period of Shloshim, we are mourning the loss of Bima Diltz, son of Wayu Diltz, Sanford Zeman, father of Bob Zeman, Paula Stoller, sister-in-law of Lori Conway, Ruth Bader Ginsburg, and Carol Goldstein, sister of Susan Hyman. Today marks a yard site, an anniversary of passing for Jenny Berger, Harry Berlowitz, Marilyn Berman, Jay Browse, Rosetta Delheim, Sylvia DiMatteo, Niaz Egi, William Gerard, Leo Kanner, Dorothy Lisson, Leo Litmanovich, Charles Mc McNamee, Bell Paulin Mills, Marvin Moore, Annette Newman, John E. Page Sr., Lloyd Paperno, Dorothy Pies, George, Ruth, Milton, Rosen, Pauline Rosnick, Margie Roth, Ray Rudin, Eric Silverman, Bertha Skirker Stone, Barney Snyder, Stanley Spectorman, Ruth Schifrin, Strauss, 
William Zimmerman and Myron Zuckerman. If there are other names that you would add to either list, please share those names aloud with us at this time or add them to the chat box. We are mourning also the loss and remembering Rosalind Hickey and Leslie Stein. Let us include in our prayers those whose names we might not know, but those who should be remembered, who are in our, our hearts as we say, Zichronam Livracha, may their memories be for a blessing, and we join together in the words of the mourners' Kaddish. Yit Kadal, Yit Kadash, Shme Rabbah, Be'alma, Divrach, Yerotei, V'yamlich, Malchutei, V'chaye Chon, V'yamei Chon, V'chaye Dechol, Be'et Yisrael, Ba'agala, Uvizman Kari, V'imru, Amen. Yehesh me rabba me barach le olam ome omaya. Yit barach vish tabach vit paar vit ramam vit nase. Vit adar vit ale vit alal shme de kudisha brihu. Le elam in kol birchata vishirata. Tush bechata venechamata. Da me ran be alma vimru. Amen. Yehesh lama rabba min shemaya. Bechaim alenu be al kol yisrael vimru. Amen. Of se shalom bim ramav. Hu ya se shalom. Aleinu ve'al kol Yisrael ve'al kol Yoshvei Tevel v'imru. Amen. May the one who creates harmony on high bring peace to us, to all who mourn, to all Israel, as we join together in saying, Amen. Amen. Please be seated. Let us, let us share some announcements together. We, uh, we, we want to, again, Mazel Tov Reba on the birth of her grandson and are so thankful that you could join us from Italy and, uh, and celebrate with us and, uh, and, and we're so delighted that, uh, that you are here with us. We want to thank uh, both Susan and Pauline for their beautiful, beautiful Torah readings and, uh, and, and for those, for, for, for Bob and for Reba as well for, for uh, honoring us with, with the Eliot. We want to, to remind you that there is a religious school tomorrow at 9.30 and, uh, and to, to note the, uh, the, the change in time for those of you who have older students in, in Kesher. We want to uh, make sure that you note that the social action committee meeting is at 1 p.m. There was uh, an error in one of the publications. It's at 1 p.m. tomorrow. There's a social action book discussion at 7 p.m. on Tuesday, October 13th. And on Wednesday, October 14th, the Women's Chavara has a writing memoirs program at 7 p.m. More information can be found about both of those on our website. Next Friday night, October 16th, is Erev Shabbat with, uh, with our guest speaker, Larry Marks and Tef Stephanie Townsend, who will be uh, sharing with us for Children's Sabbath, a national program around child children's advocacy. Please do join us for, uh, for, for that opportunity as well. And we want to also offer a muzzle talk to Roseanne Kress on, on the, the marriage of her son, Nate, to Muriel this past weekend. And to, uh, to, to let you know, for those who follow Image Out or who have not yet had a chance to follow, follow the Image Out Film Festival, it is virtual this year, so not too much travel time is needed. You can uh, look October 8th through 18th, so that is now. There are four good Jewish-themed films in the lineup. One of them is called Minion, a second Shiva Baby, a third Tahara, and the fourth Sublet. So you can find that information on imageout.com for information and to order tickets. And then uh, looking ahead, if you want to be involved in, in the next lay-led service that was so, those two that were so wonderful over the summer, please be in touch with Lindsay Hagen as, uh, you know, and, and indicate your, your um, interest in participating. Any other announcements that we should know about? Well, we see some squares that say vote. So you have heard me say each and every week, vote, vote, vote. Please, please do, do what you can. Um, it is uh, our sacred obligation to, to be a part of our community, to not separate ourselves from our community and to do our part and in voting. And if you need any help with that, there are any number of people on social action uh, or, or in the temple office who can help you with those logistics if need be. Do it safely, please, and, uh, and, and be sure to, to cast your vote. Any other news that we should know about? Any, any, uh, any simchas? Ellen, thank you for sharing your simcha in your square. Oh, cute. Oh. 
Right. We have our, 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 we have two of our youngest governors today, right? We have one in, one, one in Milan and one in, in, uh, in Pittsburgh. We were so grateful. <laughs> we're so grateful. Right. Yeah. Any, any other announcements that we should, that we should know about? Oh, he's so cute. Okay. Okay. Well, we will continue as we conclude. Well, join for our um, Kiddush. Um, Baruch atah Adonai Eloheinu melech haolam Boreh peri ha-yofen L'chaim. Amen. L'chaim chayim tovim. And before we begin our festive meal, we'll say hamotzi. Baruch atah Adonai Eloheinu melech haolam Hamotzi l'chaim min ha-aretz. Amen. We'll conclude with the Ha'er Neina, and um, because it's Simchat Torah, you're welcome to get up and dance in your squares, uh, use instruments as we honor the Torah, it's Chaim, uh, the tree of life and the way of life. And you only need to you only need to dance from your waist up. So you're for those of you who have any hesitancy about dancing, you can just dance for your from your waist up. Bring bring joy, right? The the songs, right? The songs that have graced our lives, the Torah that strengthens us, the people who we are remembering, this community that we are thankful for. Show us show us by way of your dancing in and moving in your square. Show us the joy uh, that that we, we hope and aspire you have found uh, over this over this season. Please join us for our closing song. <laughs> Sameach and Shabbat Shalom. We are, as always, so happy to see you and, and, uh, and, and to see your joy in your faces. We will unmute you and, uh, and wish you all a Shabbat Shalom and a Chag Sameach. Chag Sameach. Chag Sameach. Chag Sameach, everybody. Mazel Tov, Thank you. <laughs> Shabbat shalom. Shabbat shalom. Thank you for joining us. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Oh, Eli, so cute. Wow. Nice. Look at that, Ellen. He's davening. He's davening. Yes. <laughs> I think Ellen's. Thanks. He's so gorgeous. Gorgeous. Beautiful. He's there. He's teasing, right? Is he teasing? Today. Okay. No, is he teasing? Is he coming out? Yes, too. Oh! Bachelor. Mazel tov. Bachelor. Everybody. Oh, so gorgeous. Oh. Reba, mazel tov. Mazel Thank tov. you, Steve. This is, this is what's left of our sukkah. <laughs> Where? <laughs> There's that just... Book. Oh. Okay. That's nice you had a sukkah. Oh, nice. Everything's on the ground. No. That's great. It, it is indeed temporary, right? Our sukkot are supposed to be temporary, and so they are in, in Rochester, so they are. <laughs> Everywhere. Yeah, no right. Hi, Steve. Good to see you. Chag <laughs> Sameach, everybody. Chag Sameach. Love to see you, Please, love to see you, Steve. Thank you. This is to see you. my little cousin. <laughs> Oh, hi, Sharon. So hi. <laughs> oh, Sharon. <laughs> yes, Sharon, I didn't recognize you at first when you came on. It looks so different. Yeah. It looks great. It looks great. A new look. I love it. I love it. Yeah, I, beautiful. I don't know. I'm getting used to it. I don't know. Very good. Thank you. Look at <laughs> it. Well, 
Oh, Sharon, Sharon, he loves it too. 